Hello YouTube, it's Darren here again with another haul video. This one is um, actually from last Wednesday, which was the 11th of December. I would have had it up online earlier, um, but for the fact that I was waiting for a couple of items to arrive in the post, a couple of comics that I can't uh, or weren't, wasn't able to get from my local comic shop, so I had to get off eBay or the internet. Anyway, they've arrived today. I've just come home from work, opened the packages, and it's um, what I was expecting, so I'm really happy about that. So I'll try and rattle through these as quick as I can, so as not to keep you waiting too too long. Um, so, first off, from DC Comics, we've got Batman number 26, continuation of the Zero Year storyline. And then Batman Black and White number four. Uh, I picked this up, um, Legends of the Dark Knight number one. It's a hundred page issue. This is not something that I've been reading when it's been released on a monthly basis, but I noticed that they had it on Forbidden Planet for quite a substantial amount cheaper than it was anywhere else. Um, so. I thought I'd pick it up. 100 pages of Batman for about £4.50. So, um, like I said, I don't know too much about it, but 100 pages of Batman's got to be good, hopefully. And then lastly from uh, DC, we've got Justice League 25, uh, continuing the Forever Evil storyline. Moving on to Marvel, I've got uh, Captain America Living Legend uh, this is the last issue part 4 um, mainly collecting this for the Addy Granoff covers and then one of the items that I was waiting for was this copy of the Mighty Avengers number 4 which is the variant issue this is not something that I'm picking up but I have been collecting these Avengers 50th anniversary variant covers and I believe now I've got the full set. Um, I've got 12 of them and I'm assuming that they've been released over a period of 12 months to celebrate the anniversary year, the 50th anniversary. And I think the telltale sign as well is that there doesn't appear to be any continuation on this right hand side like there has been. Because obviously all of these issues um, sort of form one huge long picture so what I'm hoping to do is in the near future uh, probably over the Christmas holiday period is do a short video where I put all of these together along the floor and uh, just show you what it looks like then we've got Superior Spider-Man number 23 which continues the Darkest Hours storyline and Uncanny X-Men number 15 which is continuing the Inhumanity tie-in. And moving on to the Independents I've got issue 3 of Death Sentence by Monty Nero and Dowling. Um, if you're not picking this up you're probably going to find it very hard or very expensive to uh, get hold of the first issue. Um, but what I would advise is when it comes out in trade paperback, pick it up because it really, really is fantastic. Absolutely love this. And finally from Image, we have number 118 of The Walking Dead, which carrying on the All Out War storyline. And again, um, I purchased this one from Infinity and Beyond so that I could get the signed version by Charlie Adlard um, and I've got the certificate of authenticity there um, I'm really pleased because I'm, I think now I, my run of signed issues goes back to about 108 so I've got about a run of 10 signed issues and then on top of that I've got a couple of odd issues like the um, the uh, Tyrese special the one shot that I've got signed as well so that's it for my last week's comics. Um, hopefully um, I'll be a bit quicker again getting um, today's comics up. 
um, but I'll get that up as soon as I can. Also, uh, I'm really hoping that the next video that I do is going to be a review. Um, I'm getting something sent to me in the post from America um, and the guys who produce it have asked me if I can do a review of it on YouTube. So I'm just waiting for that to arrive and then as soon as it does I'll get it read and get a, a video quickly up. So thanks for watching. Um, I'd also, just before I finish, just like to do a really big thank you to the members of the um, Facebook community and the YouTube comic community who um, uh, have subscribed to me in the past few days. I've just recently joined the YCC on Facebook and um, I've had quite a number of people subscribe to me as a result of that so I no longer feel as though I'm just talking to myself so thanks for that if you've subscribed uh, and if you haven't please free t feel free to or to leave any comments like the video, dislike it, whatever you want to do. Okay thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you again next time.